Okay, here's the story. Mary and I went to Indie Alliance, and during casual conversation, I mentioned my recent obsession with typewriters. Laura then said that she wants to type her next book on a typewriter. Now I'm on a special mission to find an affordable typer I can give to her. Yesterday, just as a church garage sale is closing up, they let me have this thing for next to nothing. I opened it up, and once I overcame writer's block, I typed my triumphal tale of acquisition. But damn, it jammed. So, in addition to having to replace the lost grommet, which luckily had fallen inside the body of the typewriter, I had to clean the mechanism and straighten a bent push rod. Now, all is well. I wanted to see how fast it could go. I'm not a fast typist, but I like to think I can bang on things faster than most folks because I spent so much time banging fast on drums. The first couple attempts jammed because I got off perfect rhythm, but the last one makes it clear that the mechanism can keep up with me as long as I get off one key before hitting the next. This machine impressed me with some cool features like the half space and auto space. I had never seen the spacebar repeat on a manual typewriter. The coolest thing though is the add a key system. They sold sets for engineering, medical, and other special situations. Two of the keycaps can be snapped off and on, and the two type bars have replaceable character units. I think this was made by Smith Corona for J.C. Penney's branding. Anyway, it was fun to get to know this cool machine, and now Laura can get started on her book. Happy typing!